Thanks everyone for watching my earlier video with my five tips for the fastest Pinewood Derby car. And today I want to do another quick video just on number one, working on the wheels and axles. So I pulled, made another chart here. We're going to go over a couple quick things. In the sake of time, I just opened up the box, pulled out a few things, and got stuff ready so we can get through this quick. But number one is a graphite test. Then we're going to sand the wheel lightly. We're going to work on the nail and then more graphite. So here's the graphite test. Here's a nail and a, and a tire fresh out of the box. And we're just going to spin it and just to kind of compare how, how it does with graphite versus without. So, in fact, I'm going to do these both at the same time. Uh, for graphite on this one, you pop it inside the middle here. Uh, flip it over. Make sure lots of graphite's coming out. Spin it. Put more in the... I'm, I'm kind of pounding to try and get down inside in between the, the nail and the... Uh, the wheel. That's why I go over here and then as I lift it up I'm getting a lot of graphite in there. So this one has graphite and this one doesn't. And let's just kind of see if I can spin these at the same time here. Might be difficult but alright. First the graphite then without graphite and so that one's stopping now. The graphite's still rolling even though I spun it first. So you see the graphite's gonna do, add a lot to your wheel. So make sure you pack it in with graphite. Now, we're gonna jump to number three here since I have the nail all set up. Work on the nail. A, a brand new nail out of the box is gonna have, uh, you know, little rough spots at the head of the nail, some rough spots on, on the shaft of the nail, and we wanna file that down and make it nice and smooth. So, I put it in my drill here, uh, cut a couple strips of, uh, of sandpaper. I got 150 grit and 320 grit. I'm just going to turn this on, put on my safety glasses. And you always want to wear safety goggles when you're doing this stuff. And turn this on. And you'll see as I as I run it through here, I'm going to move it back and forth. If you hold it in the same spot, eventually it's going to snap the paper in half. Now, you, you probably can't really tell. Let me just kind of look up. But, uh, yeah, so that head files away from the shaft of the nail to have as less friction and as, as little as you can against the wheel. So, um, where's my nail that I was doing some graphite on? Looks like this one. So, here, uh, you start putting some graphite back on this baby. Load it up. So then you just want to keep working that and spinning it, add more graphite, keep working it, spinning it, and uh, that should be a nice, smooth, fast wheel. So that guy's ready. Now, that was working on the nail. That is also covering more graphite. Just keep loading up the graphite as much as you can when you're all done. But let's go back to number two, sand the wheel lightly. So let me open up this uh, drill bit. And I'm just gonna clamp around on the outside of the wheel here so I don't ruin anything on the interior of the wheel. So, there we go. So tighten that up lightly. Again, uh, grab some, 
this is uh, the 320 grit paper. Turn this guy on and I'm just going to sand and, and make that nice and smooth. Just making sure there's no little uh, little rough spots on the outside of the wheel. Oh, one more thing while I still have this in here. Let's do that again. I'm going to put a little graphite on this pipe cleaner. And run it through the middle here. Again, you can't have enough graphite. Oops. Take that baby off and put the nail in and get a nice smooth, uh, nice smooth wheel when it's all said and done. So those are the tips on working on the nails. Work through, uh, it's not a lot of work, but if you, if you go through each nail, you know, about 10 minutes on each and uh, work them out, that's the, that's the biggest key for a fast car.